Hey guys, what's going on? Tenebris here. Welcome back to the channel. So today I thought I'd talk about something which has been on my mind recently, and I've tweeted about this a few times, and there was also a tweet by Archibot about this, and I thought I'd talk about how Minecraft as a game kind of has wasted potential, and what exactly that means, and kind of where I hope the developers of the game go going forward. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Now, what exactly do I mean by Minecraft being wasted potential? Well, if you think about it, a lot of the most popular games that are around nowadays, like Fortnite, PUBG, and Black Ops 4, all revolve around a kind of battle royale type of game mode and type of interesting style of game mode where you have to spawn on a map and then you loot different areas of the map and then you fight, you know, you fight people in a big arena. And I, I think that that kind of concept really goes, I mean, the at least the popular version of the concept really goes back to a Minecraft server known as MCSG, which was popular. I think it shut down in 2016, but it was popular, you know, in the first half of the decade. And all of those concepts kind of stemmed from that. And I'm not saying that they copied. Obviously, Fortnite and those games are much different than MCSG. I'm just saying that Minecraft had that idea, or its Minecraft server had that idea way before all of these Battle Royale games came out. Then in 2016, of course, MCSG shut down and because they were overrun by hackers, because they had a bad anti-cheat, a lot of the players switched over to Bad Lion, which had a better anti-cheat at the time. And then, you know, from there, survival games really never was what it was before. And something which I noticed that I thought was very weird is Mojang at the time and around this time kind of started enacting policies that were, were effectively anti-server. So in 2014, Mojang effectively enacted something called the EULA, which is like an end user license agreement. And it basically said that any server that wanted to start up or any server which was running at the time had to agree to this agreement, which basically said that they could not sell items at in their shop. They could only sell certain things. And I think that, I mean, of course, people don't like scummy servers selling, you know, some random item for $3 in regular money. But I think that the approach that Mojang took to this was pretty, pretty bad. And, you know, I think it had major negative consequences uh, going forward for the game. Now, some people may dispute this, but I seriously think that if Mojang took a different approach, like instead of trying to shut down servers which violated the EULA and kind of prevent servers from monetizing their networks, what they should have done is they should have taken a percentage of what every server makes. If they took 3% of what every Minecraft server was making and they did not enact the EULA in the way they did, they would make way more money. And it would be a much better company decision overall, and Minecraft would be worth way more. And I think, I sincerely think that this EULA is one of the main reasons multiplayer Minecraft has actually died off. Now, I'm not saying that this is the only reason. There's lots of other reasons, like the, like the lack of anti-cheat that I've talked about before. But this is one of the main reasons, in my opinion. And I think that this is really just wasted potential. You know, Mojang, what Mojang should have done from the start is, I mean, they had the game mode, Battle Royale, essentially, survival games, it was called survival games back in 2012 that what they should have done is they should have created their own servers and they tried to do this a little bit with realms but it didn't really work out you know they should have created their own servers and they should have had this game mode they could partner with chad the dj or the people from mcsg and they should have monetized it like kind of like fortnite does and i think that that would work out a lot better we would be in a much better situation nowadays if mojang decided to do that instead of trying to effectively bottleneck servers that are trying to make money and I mean, another main reason that I think that Minecraft has a lot of wasted potential is the fact that the competitive scene in the game has never really been tended to by Mojang or Microsoft or any of the people, uh, any of the owners of, of, of the game and developers of the game. They kind of just ignore it. They kind of want to focus on survival by adding new blocks or adding new mobs like they did in the aquatic update, adding new biomes and stuff like that. They don't really add anything new to combat. And, and, and I mean, when they do add things to combat, it ends up being a negative thing. Thing, like they massively change the hit delay or whatever and everyone doesn't like it so i i think that mojang could probably make some better decisions up at the top and this is just constructive criticism but yeah i mean i just think that microsoft and mojang in general need to take a better look at the you know multiplayer side of the game and look at you know you know survival games turns into battle royale Bed Wars, Sky Wars, those game modes might turn into something in the future. We should probably capitalize on that and then, you know, work with Hypixel and work with these servers, you know, Pop PvP, work with servers which 
are creating these game modes in some way and, you know, give them an anti-cheat, you know, help them monetize their products and stuff and make it so it's a positive net gain for everyone. Update, you know, update them, give them a lot of uh, development development tools and stuff like that. And, and all of that would massively help the... And, and I'm not saying that I want Mojang to control these servers, by the way, but I, w I want them to kind of help out. But I think that that would massively help the game in the long run. Anyway, these are just my thoughts. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Peace out. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Peace.